Action Comics number 19, December 1939, published by DC Comics. This issue actually marked the run of consecutive Superman covers that continues all the way to the present day. This issue went on sale October 24th, 1939. The editor at DC at this time was Vincent Sullivan. There is a Billy Wright pedigree copy of this book, as well as a Rockford pedigree copy. Superman is featured on the cover drawn by creator Joe Schuster in this early superhero comic book cover, the final issue of the 1930s and the start of the golden age officially where superheroes are dominating the covers full time. The Purple Plague is the title of the 13 page Superman story from the team of Siegel and Schuster featuring Clark Kent as Superman, Dr. Travers and the villain Ultra Humanite. A purple black sweeps metropolis, killing citizens left and right. Only Dr. Travers has discovered antidote, and Superman must stop the ultra-humanite from killing the good doctor and prevent that cure from being used. Pat Morgan appears in a six-page story written by Gardner Fox with art by Fred Gardiner. Clip Carson appears in a six-page story called The Ivory Safari Part 1, written by Bill Finger with art by Bob Kane. Tex Thompson is a 10-page story drawn by Bernard Bailey, titled The Zombies Part 1. Zaytera Master Magician is featured in 11 pages in a story called The Gorilla King, written by Gardner Fox with art by Fred Gardiner. Action Comics number 19 was officially the best-selling comic book of the month on the newsstands. Heritage Auctions is the world's largest collectibles auctioneer, with 40 collectible categories and nearly 1 million online bidder members. Whether you're an experienced collector hunting for that elusive item, or a novice considering the sale of a valuable family heirloom, put the expertise and market strength of Heritage Auctions to work for you. Visit us today at HA.com to find out for yourself why Heritage Auctions is the world's largest collectibles auctioneer. <laughs> 